What's up, y'all? Okay, today I'm like really excited because we doing like an art unboxing today about a product of Amazon. And so um, I'm just gonna get right to it. I'm gonna open it up and use it and I guess review it. So let's get right into it. You heard what I was saying? Okay, I'm excited. Okay, first off though, like I don't know how to open. I ain't never had a box like this before. So, oh, it's got instructions. Clever. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, that ain't work. What? Hmm. I don't understand what was wrong with the original box design, but you know, this is fine. Or whatever. Or is it? Okay. I, I can't say I know what the purpose of that box was, but that's not what's most important here. What's most important is Le Product. Ta -da. Oh, no. Are you... <laughs> I got this because... Oh, it's heavy. It's heavy. I thought this was plastic. See, this is just a little tip. Just read, y'all, when y'all order stuff. Okay, read. But basically what this is, is it is a little... It is a, <laughs> it's basically, it's a hold your water when you're painting, right? And so, um, I've been using jars and I didn't like, like, I have my jar here, you know, it's got, still got, it's, it looks weird, but that's water with yellow paint, I promise you. Um, let's put that aside. But, um, yeah, this is basically another little container like that, except for it has this thing in it. Oh, it's a coil is what they call it. Golly, this thing. They ain't playing. It really must be glass. Shoot. Dang. All right. <laughs> All right. So the difference is, is that it has this coil in it, right? And the purpose of this coil is to help you clean off your brush without damaging it, right? So this is definitely plastic. I mean, not plastic. This is definitely definitely glass which is you know a little disappointing uh disappointing disappointing but you know we're gonna give it a try anyway it was like 12 dollars. it's not much of a sacrifice so i'm gonna go get some fresh water so i can do a little demonstration all right y'all so i was gonna show y'all like you know what it looked like with water in it but <laughs> it's already failed one of the tests and i didn't even try to test it yet the whole like it's it's, look at this, hold on. I don't know how to show you from this angle. That is water pouring out the side of this. I've, I've closed it as tight as I possibly can. And it's just, it's just dripping. It's dripping on my mouse pad, no less. But hey, you know what? I'm thinking that perhaps I should not even like fool with this paint. Because, like, I don't, I want to send it back already. <laughs> like, and I, I had such high hopes. Like, the main thing about this was that, like, it has, like, this plastic top, right? And if you look at my other, my other jar, you know, does it pass the spill test? It also does not pass the spill test. What am I doing here? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, anyway, um, they both drip oh lord i was not prepared for this okay um yeah so the whole purpose of this since they both spilling you know i guess i haven't lost anything so i guess i will try it but um the whole purpose of this is to rinse your brush off without damaging it you brush it against these coils and it'll clean it so um you know since they're both dripping i'm gonna give it a shot also the top of this is metal and that makes it hard to screw on and off sometimes but the fact that this is plastic makes it a lot easier but i guess i just have to keep in mind that i need to empty this out when i take it somewhere which is, which is something i always do because i ain't gonna take that chance in my backpack like something dripping like that when i'm going to class so yeah let's let's just let's just see if it works okay all right so now we're going to put this jar's abilities to the test what i'm going to do is i'm going to put some of this thalo blue paint on um you know my brush and you know use it some struggling on this paper or whatever 
and then rinse it off to see if it snags my um brush bristles also this is the <laughs> brush i don't really care about as much um because if it did snag my bristles when i was trying to rinse it off i wouldn't care because it was cheap anyway let's get into it. okay so i'm gonna just you i'm using this as a palette because i don't want to bring out my glass one but um, i'm just gonna you know just start painting with this dry brush you know see how that goes dry brushing Usually I would wet it first, but you know, I suspense, you know. Alright. I've painted with it. Okay. So now, now we're gonna move this to the side. And we're gonna bring the main star of this show to the center. Test it out. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I see the appeal. And it's like scrunchy. It's like a spring. So it goes down. This water? <laughs> I kind of understand why people say they want to taste paint water. <laughs> because it looks really appetizing for some reason. Don't judge me, okay? Um, it, it did the job. And it's not snagging any of my bristles at all. No matter what direction I'm taking it in. It is definitely very much doing its job. And that cleaned it a lot faster than like, you know, violently shaking your brush in the water praying that stuff gets off and then wiping it off and then doing it some more like you know so it definitely does its job and um you know just put the top back on it but know that this will still spill so you are not safe um matter of fact yeah just so i can show it to y'all one more time this the, you see the coil in there okay um you cannot take the coil out just you know for reference <laughs> in case somebody tries to buy this and take it out um Somebody, I think somebody in the Amazon comments did it, but like, you know, it's near impossible, but this is the coil that you see. So, yeah, I mean, it works as a product. I wish it was like, you know, waterproof, air airtight waterproof. I don't know how to, water, water don't come out of it. I wish water didn't come out of it, but you know, I didn't have that to begin with with my other jar, so I'm not really losing anything, and I'm honestly gaining the usage of this coil and it is a lot like well actually it's about the same weight but you know um i just feel a lot better about this in its shape like it's harder to knock over um this one you know hard to screw on the top so yeah i think it's a worthwhile investment anyway that's the review um hope you guys enjoy this video thank you for watching and i'll see you next time don't forget to like and subscribe Peace.